What's up, y'all? It's Ashley Keaton from Enjoy the Process. I'm out here. This dude already had one birthday party. I guess I'm going to another one. Who does he think he is? He got a Gucci cake? You need to put that cake on your shelf. That's not an eating cake. That's a trophy cake. It tastes like I was eating pieces of the Bible. Leather just falling off the cake. I just rolled it up and put the leather in my pocket. Gonna make me a Bible out of it later. This ain't no edible cake. It's a trophy cake. You got diamonds glistening. I think I... <coughs> I think I ate one of the diamonds off the cake, bro. I think I choked on the diamond. All right, just park behind the Mustang. Park, park behind the Mustang and give the people my keys. Who does he think he is? This man renting a hotel. Give my keys to the person parked behind the Mustang. I don't know who these people are. Why are you renting a hotel for your birthday? You better got it like that. I need to get on your plan. If you if you renting hotels just for a birthday. This is second weekend. Like, bro, you got a birthday weekend. This your second week. This your 29th. What you gonna do on your 30th? You have a birthday month? You gonna be in France somewhere eating snails? This what they talking about. Your friends are, are basketball players and you just a comedian. You talk to me like that again. What's up, man? It's your boy John. It's gonna be your part. See, this is what people do when when they got it like that, but they camera guy ain't got it like that. You see what I'm saying? Hold on, hold on. I can't see. Is this the right? Oh, this is nice. Wait a minute, John. This better be okay. That's cough John, syrup. The party hasn't started because everybody said it was waiting on you. But you look at that. Wait, what type of party is this? Because I can't be doing everything. You know what I'm saying? I'm a Christian. Yeah. Bye, love. Smooches. <laughs> I can't do every type of party. I can do the, the party at your grandma's house. The life of John Lasseter. Hey! That boy got swag. Guys, these are the Publix cookies. You know those are the best. Everybody say, John, you get in a regular room? Heavens no. No. I know everybody gonna be like, bro. You probably got that custom installed for your room. See, that's why you don't never let people know how you move. Real G's moving silence. And a lot of people see me got this room, they start counting my dollars. But guess what? Can't count my dollars. No. the way I move, it's unpredictable. And you say it's unpredictable, but I was at your last birthday party. I already knew what you was about to do. I knew you could not have a simple birthday at your mama's house. Oh. No. <laughs> Let me put diamonds in the pool so they can see me shine. I don't always sleep at hotels, but when I do, I sleep at the W. See, that's what I'm talking about. The people like to sleep at the W and they think that you're just okay with paying $10 an hour for parking. <laughs> I won't even pay that to go to the movies. I'm paying $9.50. So you think I'm gonna pay $10 to, to park? Yeah, man, just hand the dude your keys <laughs> behind the Mustang. Rich people have nervous breakdowns um, every three hours. <laughs> <laughs> Prince, I love what you do. Uh, I'm such a big fan. Thank you, sir. Hallelujah. You got ASAP Rocky in the building. How you doing, sir? Did, did y'all pay for parking? Y'all ain't pay for parking, huh? Because cause this man didn't tell me $10 of parking uh, for an hour. Well, this is where I ended up, people. That's my life. Here we go. I'm back in the building. Boom. What's up, yo? I'm vlogging, bro. Vlogging? Vlogging. That sounds like vlogging. Fl hey! That's when you're spanking someone very hard. Yeah. Well, I'm not doing that. Oh, <laughs> you're not vlogging, are you? I'm not vlogging, I'm just vlogging. <laughs> Alright. What you got in that cup, bro? Alright, so. Because we're watching you. Is this stuff gonna put anything on me if I grab your tiki Wait, pole? Let's go! Three, four, five, six, seven. And one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and six. Yeah! <laughs> Did you just record? Who are you recording? Why? You're, you're very lame. <laughs> but you're the only one that's working out. Yeah, you just got hurt. You need to <laughs> That's how them bodybuilders be, they. Let me go halfway. Why you making that sound? You should say my brother. Wait a minute. You got to get the motion. You're a real warrior, bro. Or a sissy? Which one? Uh, clumsy. Clumsy. You just gotta believe in yourself. You gotta get angry, man. 
<laughs> Don't tell me. Tell me when you're... I'm about to sing my song now. <laughs> go ahead. Go ahead. Stand by her, bro. Kill it. Kill it. Thrill it. Chill it. Zill it. Seal it. Gotta go dead, too, man. They just lying, bro. They always say this. You know, like, when your gas is, like, on heat, but it's, like, it's not on heat. <laughs> Nah. I'm saying you go ten more miles. You know your car. Right. At that time, John knew his car. He had to oh, take a walk. Do you remember this? Oh, you were there. He's a great, he's a great guy. I tell you, want to get some exercise. Ride with John when he's on the because you're gonna get it. But she gets it. She, she says that makes sense. That's probably why they painted it. Some liminal messages are real, folks. So we have this picture here. You see the corners again. I'm not gonna say anything. You should be a speaker, man. I'm not gonna get into politics. Appreciate you, brother. You should, you should be a rapper. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you have this blue circle. See, anything that's in this blue circle is sad. Blue represents a certain amount of uh, animosity. <laughs> he says everybody in right. the blue circle. <laughs> the, uh, the bloodlines that run through the main arteries. <laughs> <laughs> it out. Hey, look, you see this area right here. <laughs> It's all going upward. If you see the way they stroked it, the, the, the paint strokes, you, you really have to pay close attention to the detail. There's, there's a certain amount of blue in there, and then there's red. Be careful. That's all I'm saying. But you see blue and red, be careful. Because those are signs of <laughs> subliminal context that cannot be taken lightly. Like. And then you have your gray areas. We don't know what's going on. That's what I'm saying. The media is, this is, this is a plain expression of the media today. You have your black and white area, you know what's going on, but the gray areas are... Why are you really recording and saying it? 